Sophia here from my great challenge welcome back to my channel this is video number seven I think of my staircase makeover you can tell on the left of the screen that I have finished the crown molding I said well not the crown molding the step molding I said I was gonna do that behind the camera and I did I just have to sand it um, because I still have some of the putty on it however the one on this side here is all sanded and I've already started painting so you can tell here that I've painted the post um, I only have two coats on it I need to do a third coat so here's the post that was moved uh, by an entire step with a little jacket I did around it and I didn't paint the paneling yet but I started painting um, this area here and all of the molding and I started painting on the edges here as well and here is the part that I did last week so all of this here I have one coat of paint and same thing here on oh I need to remove this before it starts showing too much uh, I'll do that in a second uh, so I started all of the molding here all of that's got one coat of paint right and what am I doing today um, I'm just gonna give you little bits and pieces here and there I need to tape everything with the frog tape and I'm going to do everything that's white basically so this is all gonna get uh, done with the roller this is all gonna be done with the brush and I'm doing all of the risers today then if I have time and I think I have some leftover yellow I'm gonna patch the areas where the yellow needs to be uh, patched like here and a few areas over there and then maybe maybe I'll finish up um, the steps which I got so let me get started I'm just gonna work for about two hours that's it and I don't want to spend the whole day on this because the project itself is almost finished let me show you what it looks like from above right don't mind the mess I'm still working so this is what the staircase looks like from above and again the steps are not finished I still have to do one more coat of stain and then um, the polyurethane on it so yeah I'm really really liking this look so I'll see you in a second okay so I'm starting with putting my panda tape all around the edges and then when I'm done with painting all the white, I'll have to do the painter's tape on the other side. So right now I'm just doing it on the stained side. Because when I'm painting here, I don't want any of that white stain to go on the steps. I'm using the Bare Premium Plus Interior Semi-Gloss Enamel in Ultra Pure White. This is a paint and primer in one. I love Bare Paint. I'm going to show you a little bit here. Um, you see, it's uh, just semi-gloss. It's not a full gloss. And what it means is that it's reflecting light, but it's not super, super shiny. This is one coat of all of the white including the risers um, it's obviously still very tacky so I can't really do anything now I just gotta wait for the whole thing to dry so I can go ahead and do 
a second coat but so far it's looking you know pretty good um, I have some white spots here and there that I need to sand but again the steps I pre-stained them so that way I could uh, get them you know a little bit dirty I don't have any problem with that I'll just resend really quick by hand before I put another coat of stain and then for the schlag I purchased this I've never tried it before this is the Cisner no Zinser uh, bullseye schlag it's a sealer and a finish and this one is in amber color so I'm wondering what it's gonna look like on this but right now it's dirty there's a lot of dust from all of the um, sanding of the putty and whatnot so the steps are not looking their best but that's all right and here I'm just gonna leave it like that I've just painted the whole thing with the bright white um, I still have the uh, board to do at the bottom you can tell that I did a little bit here but this is not done that will be taken care of when I do this part right here and then when I uh, redo the whole corner here with the gray is done I have um, three coats actually of the white I just removed all the tape and I had some areas where the tape took out some of the paint let me show you like right here you can see that the paint came off a little bit so I'm gonna do and in the corner right here uh, so I'm, what I'm gonna do is wash these steps and then um, wait for them to dry and I'm just gonna go ahead and do one more coat of the means wax and once that's dry then I'll start doing the shellac but for the shellac I'll do only um, every other steps and tomorrow I'll do the other one so yeah you see there's some areas like right there where the tape took out some of the uh, paint but you know what I'll go back at it with a little tiny brush otherwise everything here is done um, I do need to wash the steps because they are some um, um, what do you call it powder from the sanding on it but yeah that's the staircase so it's looking pretty pretty good and then while this was drying instead of just watching the paint dry I uh, started cleaning up the whole area here so I do have two garbage bags I need to bring down but everything's been dusted um, hold on let me show you there we go so the whole basement here is pretty much uh, clean. Everything's been mopped. This area here, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I have those two paintings, um, advertisement rather. I put them back on the wall. I might put a little table or something in the corner here. Right now I just have my ironing board for when I'm quilting. And then what I did is that I put the um, bookcase over there instead. Um, that way it keeps this whole area here empty and I like that um yeah I mean you know the laundry room is the same so there's nothing going on here and the laundry room is still um clean and stuff yeah there's a toilet you know that um so anyway let me just go ahead and take a warm um, microfiber and I'm just gonna go and wash all of those steps then give them one more layer of color and then I'll start the shellac so here are the stairs with another coat of the Gunstock by Minwax. Um, it's all dry. I'm just going to go ahead and do the schlack on every other step. So I'm going to start with not the bottom one. I'm going to start with this one. Let's see what it looks like. And you see there's some areas where you can really see the grain um, for the wood. So I know it looks like this was not um, stained, but actually is. It has all of the wood pattern on every step. It's very pretty. I like it much better than painted. So let's see what it looks like with the shark. So again, I'm using the Zinzer Bullseye Schlack. This is the traditional finish and sealer. And this is the amber one. There's another one you can get that's clear. I wanted to get a touch of additional color because um, I like the wood color 
and I want the schlack to give it a little bit more vibrance. So again I'm doing every other step and the goal here is to try to avoid bubbles um, so I'm just letting my brush drip okay fast drying it says they're not kidding when they say fast drying so I have every other step done right and you see it's got a nice sheen a little bit of the luster so it's not super shiny I don't want it to be slippery right but the first coat I put on by the time I did the one all the way on top is already dry so hmm looks like I'm finishing this tonight I'm gonna do a second coat on this so now what I like about schlack is that unlike polyurethane you actually don't have to sand it in between so this is looking really really good you guys really good okay guys I'm done uh, well for the day <laughs> and this is uh, what the side of the staircase looks like and um, yeah I didn't finish over here finish it next weekend um, I still didn't figure out what I'm gonna do with this I have the seam that shows here and on the other side so I'm definitely gonna put a little um, strip of something. I still have to do all of the gray. However, we got three coats of schlack on the steps and they are dry. Uh, it took about 45 minutes. I'm sorry, the washing machine is emptying itself right now. So yes, there are some little itty pieces here and there that I have to touch up with the white paint. However, um, this is pretty much done and it's hard to believe that it looked that bad before. I'm gonna insert a picture uh, so you can see what it looked like in case you forgot. Um, but yeah, pretty much I'd say 95% is done. 95%. Um, so I'm gonna leave you at these shiny, beautiful stairs. And that would be it for me for today. I'll talk to you later, you guys. Thank you for watching. Bye.